Okay guys, let's uh, let's get to it and do the unboxing of the second generation ring doorbell solar panel. Cost us, uh, I think it was £39, was it? £39. £39 it was, yeah. £39.95 to be precise. And we've got a uh, different languages ring solar channel, uh, solar charger, sorry. Pretty little neat box. Pop it open. Cardboard filler. Instructions in about 10 different languages by the looks of it. We've got uh, two little packages there, A and B. Hmm. And your solar panel itself. Solar panel seems to be well constructed. It's totally rubber here, so that will seal the weather away, taking it that the uh, your doorbell sits straight on top of there and yeah it's, it's got a full rubber seal all the way around so there's no weather going to get in behind it you've got your micro usb here so that's just going to plug into the micro usb on the back of your ring doorbell okay so that's pretty straightforward so all I'm going to need for installation is roll plugs and plug oh, I must have this must be what's in here is it let's have a look see what we've got yes we've got plugs and screws here and in here we have Some much smaller screws I would imagine that's for mounting this plate onto this bracket that's exactly what it's for I can see it from here okay so we've got all the bits we need there apart from what size is that looks like it's five or six mil looking for the size yeah six mil six mil on the on the masonry bit Let's dig that out. First start. It's off a six mil masonry bit. That's it, is it? Yeah. Okay. One six mil masonry bit. Right. We're ready to rock and roll here, I think. Plenty of charge in the in the old drill, so. Okay guys, as you can see, got myself a Phillips screwdriver, we've got our ring doorbell screwdriver that come with the ring doorbell, got a normal terminal screwdriver in case I need it, I've got my 6mm drill, drill plugs that come with the unit, I've got the unit itself, the solar panel charging unit itself, and some small screws there. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is going to take the plate off the back of the um, of the ring doorbell take the ring, take it off so just the two screws at the bottom with the security driver that you get with your ring doorbell just pop that off as so okay guys we've got our holes drilled four holes six mil roll plugs in place quite simply take your solar panel take your solar panel line it up four screws in place one two three 
before. Incidentally, what you will notice with these screws, they've got a small rubber washer on the end of them. So that's to stop any water getting in from behind into the unit. So this is a whole rubber plate here as well. So it's going to be totally sealed from the elements once we screw it up. That's your solar panel in place. Next comes your back plate. Like I said before, you've got a rubber back in there, you've got also got a rubber back in here. So once we put this in place, it's gonna all seal itself in nicely. Waterproof. Got four small screws. Come on, let's just put them in. Finger tight, so to say, at the beginning. Let's get them all lined up. What is nice from Ring is they send you one extra roll plug, one extra screw, one extra small screw for the plate. So if you happen to drop any like I did previously, you've got spares. Okay, so got all four in place now. Tighten him up. When you do install this plate, make sure you do it with this label to the bottom because that's where your lugs fit in when you put your ring doorbell on okay so this is the second generation ring doorbell not the first the first one's different you have to make sure you've got the right one this is for the second generation ring doorbell which is this one here with the micro usb on the back okay so quite simply this micro usb plug now pops into the back of here and then you just quite simply clip him into place. That. Then you take your security screwdriver that come with your ring doorbell and your security screws. And quite simply locate the screws in place. Half tighten one. Get the other one in place. I'll take that, this one all the way in now. There you have it. It's as simple as that. That's it installed. Okay, your ring doorbell, totally installed, totally waterproof. And there's your solar panels ready to take in the sun. Not much sun today, but we'll go inside and see what the app says. Okay. Right guys, a bit chilly out there, I'll tell you. All right, okay, let's see what we've got. I'm just going to access the uh, the Ring app on my phone. And we've got... Let's see if I can just bring it up. Yes, okay. So there's the front door, that's the camera we just fitted. Very happy with that, very happy with the layout on that as well. It's put, captured the all the front area of our garden uh, successfully now then as we know what we've done is um, install the solar panels so we need to go into the settings and here we go bring up front door and as you can see in the top right hand corner of here you've got that little green notification telling us that we are receiving power from the sun. As you saw from outside, there was no sun. It was very, very overcast today. But even in the days where it's overcast, it's still uh, taking in power from the sun, as it shows there on the notification. Okay, let's have a look at the... Just tap on that notification. I have my battery level's at 95% at the minute. So I'll have to keep an eye on that and see how it goes. But as you can see from that... Uh, from that little green emblem in the top there, it's actually charging as we speak. Okay, by no means is this to replace uh, battery or hard wiring, that I do know. So, it makes it less frequent 
for when you have to charge your battery. That's the whole idea. But it depends on usage, I suppose, what you have it set up to do. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm going to keep my eye on that and we'll see where we go. Uh, the one good thing about it is, of course, you're not drilling through the walls, you're not drilling through your door frames. It's quite simply taking power from the sun. So we'll just see how it goes. And I'll get back to you and let you know exactly how it went on. <laughs> Catch you in a bit. ta -da. Okay, viewers, if you like what you see, pop your comments in below and don't forget to hit that like button and the notification bell because we love it when you do that. And don't forget to share. See you soon in my next presentation. Catch you later. It's not your boy Leroy. Signing off. Ta-da!